Alright guys, Mr. Calimesh here outside though. Um, today I'm trading this white superpower, Swag Beyond Belief, for Reebok 9K. Um, it's starting with Jim Wax. I'm going to unstring it before I give it to him because uh, he lives near me. But first I wanted to do a Calimesh versus Jim Wax video. Um, so first of all, I'm just going to be as honest as I can because I have a good relationship with Jim Wax or with Jim Wax, but I'm not going to tell them that they have a, like the best product ever because um, just because I have a good relationship with them. So I'm going to be honest. Um, first impressions, I have it in my room, but when like I had all this wax. After I strung it, all this wax came off and it was on my carpet. But there's still wax on the mesh, so I think they do two coatings of the wax. But the entire first coating just comes off. A ton of wax come off, comes off when you're stringing it. The one you're just pounding it, you can kind of see it. Anyway, um, it stretches nicely. It's easy to form a pocket. It doesn't break in very easily, like East Coast Mesh and Cali Mesh does. Um, like I threw with them for the same amount of time, and Cali Mesh is way softer. I'll do a little ball drop test. Um, hold on one second. All right, I'm gonna do a ball drop test. Okay, so first is Jim Wax. So that's it made like a pretty good dent. And then next is Cali Mesh. So when we compare, they make Cali Mesh makes a bigger dent because it's softer. Um so yeah, let me pound the pocket side again. I like Cali Mesh better because it breaks in faster, but you guys may not believe me. Um, so you should do a little comparison video yourself. Um, but yeah, Jim Wax is still a good product. It's just Cali Mesh is cheaper, and I think our coating stays on better. Um, but yeah, anyway, that's a little comparison between uh, Cali Mesh and Jim Wax Mesh. Thanks for watching.